um, comment that you're disregarding that it hasn't just because we've gifted them or watched them does not mean that we've literally had um <clears throat> a, a, you know it, it doesn't mean that we we you're we should stop talking about it i'm physically affected on more than one level he had um, everyone leaving thinking he was leaving the app because he was seriously ill he well, had everyone what, what, believing that he was leaving because there was something wrong with him and feeling sorry for him. Now, Kim. But yeah. also what I don't understand is, I, and I get what people are saying, like, this is, TikTok's to blame for this. TikTok, but I don't really understand what, what you want TikTok as an organisation to do. Like I said before, you can't DBS everyone that, that, that does a live stream. And even if he was DBS, when he first joined the app, his DBS would have technically been clear unless there was previous charges, which obviously we don't know about. But you, what what TikTok can't check court dates every day, like uh, unless and so like like we were saying earlier, you don't know people's put full name. Like a lot of people know Panda's Panda. Obviously, I know her, her official real name. Like she, like for example, Cheeky Chippy. I don't even know what his first real name is. So you don't know people, but like like by their name. So how do, how would a a company like this? I understand they need to be tighter with their registration process in regards to. Did you mean to invite me in? Oh, well, why not? Hello. <laughs> we'll have we'll a man that has yeah. the process of making it hard. Like when joining the app, they need more information. I fully get that. But even if, for example, Cheeky McChick gave his full name, his address, his date of birth, there's still like what, what you, still what what can TikTok do to check that he's not uh, maybe a predator or uh, you know? I'll, I'll tell you another reason that this yeah, needs highlighting and people need to be talking about it. Last night, I was in a chat and people were saying, "Hold on, Paul Lion King done this," and I'm like, "No, no, 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 oh, no, 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 you know." And and I'm like I'm, I'm jumping into boxes that I would never normally go in, sort of like justifying the fact that no, hold on, it's not Paul, it's Anthony. It's not my husband. It's not him. Just it's because of the right. username. So that's the that's the issue, isn't it? Because like when I've said, well, he's changed Lanking, his name now. People have gone, oh, yeah. And people have, like I've said, Lankings doing a dare on Monday. They've gone, oh, they've, 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 they've heard it before. Morning, Jay. That oh the one that sings Lion King no he's the one because that gave so many lions mm. that he's not his name was Lion King and you it's so distorted yeah. and everything becomes such a blurry mess and it's okay. just thank you smile out and literally it's like absolutely ridiculous how that the people will now then continue the rumors and it becomes Chinese whispers and it I, I, it's yeah. me. So for somebody to come in like that, Marky Mark, I do follow him and I won't be because for somebody to say and disregard that people Morning, have emotions yeah. created due to and uh, that we should just stop talking about it. To be honest, though, Marky Mark had the same opinion when we was talking about the whole uh, children on the app thing. Yeah, well, this is a, like, he was very bored of hearing the topic, very bored of this. But let's be honest, we spoke about it for two weeks and then we started seeing 12 year olds and 14 year olds falling into the rising on Monday just gone. Yeah, but, and, this is what I could, cannot believe. But what it is is so what will happen is so say for example like my account. So say I let my my like, about 15, that, but say, say I let my fifteen year old use my account and he goes live on it. He's never going to get a ban because my ID is on there showing that I'm over eighteen. TikTok just flag it straight away as no violation because they've seen the ID, which is totally wrong because I I've gone and reported an account as they were about thirteen and they were sat there for ages. I was reporting for them and they were like, "You won't get me taken down because my mum showed her, my, her ID." Well, yeah. why is your mum letting the thirteen year old go live to talk to a complete? random strangers a lot of the time parents don't realize because of that so let's say parents are slightly ignorant to the way that the app's changed and the way the internet's changed so when you look at tiktok and you see the kids on it you're thinking oh they're just watching the little jason drulo videos and they're just doing that they're just doing this they don't actually realize the severity of the lives and the people that are coming in and watching your children the way so that lives are going on now no child should be watching it 100 and then, you know before you know it the kids gone live and they're earning coins and they're trying to do this that and the other with it it's just so sneaky nowadays. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, this is it. It's, I, I just think, and um, what we were saying before you came in, Kate, that, you know, how is everybody enabling what's up very blatantly in front of them as well on this app? Oh, it's it, crazy, you know, man. It's crazy. Like, it, people are so quick to gift so heavily. That yeah. They won't take five minutes out of their day to simply Google someone. You know, if you'd have Googled Anthony, yeah. this would have came up because his original charges would have been on the internet. <sighs> You see, this is the point, and that, that's what I'm no, I'll just state when... the 200 people in here. If you just simply Google someone's name, admittedly, like myself, my name, you know, I'm, cheeky, I'm name. here and I'm cheeky chippy, so you're not gonna you're not gonna find anything about me, admittedly. So just don't fucking gift me. Um, <clears throat> but someone like Anthony, if you'd have simply typed Anthony Q Lion in, that'd have probably came up with his. Um, it does. It's mine. It really does. Yeah, with his with his charge stuff, you know.
If you typed in Anthony Q Lion, it didn't come in because I did it last night to see whether it did. It, did it, it didn't come up. It's, that's the thing exactly. when what we were saying that you can change your last name on here. You can be anything you, can you want, hide. can't you? Like, I'm not that, saying oh, about yeah, you can, can spend your TikTok you career without even putting your face on the screen. Yeah, you like, can be I, I, anybody. You can, you can voice you can change. You can do anything. You could be a like, puppet, you could be anything. Person, but like, for example, like, no face, no case. Not saying that obviously he's yeah. a bad person, but you, you don't know what he looks like. You don't know what his real name is. You don't know if that's his real voice, but it's so easily done now that you know I mean? it can be anyone. I totally agree with what it, it it's becomes a bad thing when you're at, you would have to even Google everybody, wouldn't it? Because the yeah, trouble I mean. is that he, I think one of the biggest things that everybody's struggling with is that he convinced us so much that he was the most god-fearing family that we watched that baby grow up i know but let's be honest every person that's turned out to do something horrific has mm. been that kind of person yeah we're, we're, we're been the person that you didn't expect the person that done the most they were so caring they were so loving you'd have never seen it i can't believe it yeah and I, that's what a lot but of what it's made me with. think is how many people that do i class as friends that are now wrong yeah that's what we've heard that but this is what i'm saying and this is what you've got to be back careful back with about then. attaching too much emotion to the internet yeah I mean, my friends yeah. are with us. We're all so invested in a bloody app. That's the problem. The app is so controlling over your lifestyle and it's got so many addictive traits to it. You've just got to be careful. We do need another like bar this. app this app. And then I hopefully, you know, but then apparently, in, you know, all this is, you know, they, he goes and gets, obviously, chat. he's been arrested and what have you. And then he comes in and laughs about it. He's ultimately admitted that he's got... Been, got but you look, you look at Pedro, you look at Pedro sat at number four. Yes, he's being investigated by the police, but that case will take about two years to go to court for him to get found guilty or whatever. Yeah, so well, yeah, and he will take every He's going to be earning too. money off the back of people. Money, big ram. But yeah, it's like that. And then also, I mean, there's somebody very close to me right now, and the, the, they've got something going on in their family, and that person was released without any bail conditions and they will not be sentenced, not even listened to until September next year. And that person is going through hell knowing mm. that person is walking around innocent as anything. Nobody knows what the crime is. They're even on here. Um, I'm still shocked. Who would have guessed? I know. And this is what we were saying. I know, Jam. I'm, I'm absolutely fucking... It's blown. I've, I've not slept properly all night because I keep thinking, was there any signs? And the other thing is, at uh, morning, but... Uh, there wouldn't have been any signs. And in all fairness, like, sorry to have a cut, but with somebody like Anthony, you can't feel guilty or you can't feel bad because he just well, comes on, sings and has a talent. He doesn't do the whole interacting personally with a lot of people. He does obviously sub. <laughs> But you can't, you can't feel like you did wrong for gifting the talent. But oh, this no. is, I think more, it's not even that we gifted them. I also think it's more that we were so convinced this was the ideal family. He was the most that's beautiful, the, internet. the whole dad. internet is a lie. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? And it just, it's making everybody question themselves today. It's like, well, is that person actually the most, you know, loving, caring person? Is that person, whatever, you, you know, you go in, because when they turn off the screen, what are they really going to be like? And when I think the big thing as well is, is that it's become a, it was a family that play, portrayed because she sang with him and she was doing this obviously after he'd been prosecuted. And so when you see that she's taken part in this whole smoke screen, that's even worse for us, isn't it? Because we're just like... The thing is, I mean, that last day that Anthony was live, he finished on 1.9 million diamonds that he got in a day, okay, which is probably about six grand. So he got six grand. More. It's a lot more than oh, that. It's just under ten thousand dollars. So it's, it's ten. It's it's four grand per one million, isn't it? That you actually cash out. Yeah. No, it's yeah. slightly. Like, it's just under ten. It's five thousand two hundred dollars per million diamonds. Yeah. Probably. So he he knew what he had done. He knew what was going to happen, and he still went on and got that dirty money off of vulnerable people. But, but know, also, but he it as well. Like he also seen the whole Diadro thing playing out, and he just continued yeah, and was in his box, doing yeah. box battles with him. Continued to go into his boxes and yeah. stuff like that as well. 